What's good guys, if you need to make your ultimate team stronger, go to u7buy.com and buy yourself some cheap and reliable FC24 coins. Once you guys head over to u7buy.com, make sure to use my discount code DAN to get 6% off your next purchase on making that team better. Apart from FC coins, u7buy.com also provides more game services like top op mobile games, gift cards, game keys, etc. Click my link in the description and enjoy the cheapest prices now. Yo YouTube, what's going on? Welcome to another video to the channel, y'all boys. And today I'm here to give you guys the top 10 best strikers in EFC 24 Ultimate Team concluding this year's FIFA cycle. Go ahead and join me in the comment section down below. Who has been your favorite striker that has been killing it for you throughout the year for Foot Champs? Now, some ground rules for today's video because as you guys know, for the previous videos, it's another difficult list to put together. So just keep that in mind. We're most likely not going to share the same list, different opinions, different experiences with certain cards. Keep that in mind. Also, for today's list, it's going to include any type of special card that has their primary and or secondary position as a striker and or as a center forward. If they do not have their primary and or secondary position, once again, as a striker or as a center forward, they will not be included on today's list. Who's going to miss out? Well, a lot of strikers, a lot of top tier strikers did miss out on this list. As you guys do know, I do 10 plus 2 honorable mention. With that being said, let's get into the honorable mentions right now. First honorable mention was very, very difficult. It was between greats of the game, Icon Puskas, Griezmann Path to Glory, Vinicius Jr. Copa America card, Kenny Daglish, Rivaldo, Drogba, Bobby Charlton, that Copa America Lionel Messi, Footies Cantona, Footies Alex Morgan, that's a double five. Footies Butra and Footies Dembele. But I went with 98 rated Footies Icon Eto. I feel like Eto is a sleeper pick. I feel like he's very underrated. Not a lot of people talk about this card, but he's one of my favorite strikers this year. His SPC, I was a huge fan of the card. 5'10 on the height, high medium work rates, double five starting the skill moves and weak foot combination, right footed. Acceleration type is controlled, explosive. 98 pace, 96 shooting, 90 passing, 94 dribbling, 90 physicality as well. Play styles that the man Eto comes with. Chip shot, take it taka, first touch, flare, technical, and travella. All on basic. And then the four gold play styles, quick step, ping pass, power shot, and finesse shot as well. Now Eto, like I said before, a little bit underrated in my opinion. Usually not super meta in FIFA, but this card with the maxed out pace, really nice and consistent shooting one of the best finishers i've used this year in afc 24 and then you combine that with him having the two best scoring play styles on goal absolutely amazing really nice physicality top tier dribbling this card very nice and meta you guys let me know what you guys think about him for those guys that tried him out coming in as the second audible mention is going to be 98 rated greats of the game icon rivalo now i know i said in my intro that I wasn't going to include Rivaldo, but after looking on the list one more time, I had to put Rivaldo. He's just too good. He's obviously better as a winger, in my opinion, but as a striker, he gets the job done as well, in my opinion. 6-1 on the height, high, high work rates, double five star on the skill moves and weak foot combination, left footed, acceleration type is controlled, 98 pace, 97 shooting, 95 passing, 99 dribbling, 85 physicality as well. Play styles that Rivaldo comes with, Long ball pass, flare, first touch, acrobatic, and incisive pass, all on basic. And then the four gold play styles, press proven, technical, finesse shot, and dead ball as well. Really nice, if not basically maxed out dribbling. Very nice and high shooting. Very nice pace. Solid physicality as well. Double five. Same exact vibes with Eto. Eto and Rivalo usually not meta in FIFA, but this year with this 98 Rivalo, very nice. Down the wing, also very nice from the number nine spot. Coming in at number 10 is going to be 99 rated Footies Icon Mia Ham. I already know a lot of people are going to disagree with me on this. They're going to be like, she's too low, she's too low. But guys, trust me, this is a very tough list. There's a lot of good strikers. It's all about preference. 5'5 five, five on the height. That's basically the main reason why she's number 10 because of the height and the physicality. But nonetheless, still very good. High medium work rates. Double five star on the skill moves and weak foot combination. Right foot acceleration type is controlled explosive. 
97 pace, 99 shooting, 91 passing, 97 dribbling, 87 physicality as well. Play styles that she comes with. Tiki Taka, Flair, Relentless, Quick Step, all on basic. And then the four gold play styles, Rapid, First Touch, Power Shot, and Finesse Shot as well. So she has the two best scoring play styles on gold. We all know Mia Hamm's body type, or her body I should say, in FIFA this year. Really consistent shooting. Very nice and responsive dribbling. Very nice and quick with the pace. Stamina is looking pretty good as well. Double five. Like I said, only con is the height and the physicality. Aside from that, she's top 10 material. Coming in at number nine is going to be that 98 rated footies hero, David Ginola. We are looking at cards 6-1 on the height. High medium work rates. Double five stun skill moves and weak foot combination. Right footed. Acceleration type is controlled. 99 pace, 95 shooting, 92 passing, 96 dribbling, 90 physicality as well. Play styles that Mr. Ginola comes with. Chip shot, Tiki Taka, Trickster, Flare, Rapid, and Quick Step. All on basic and then the four gold play styles. First touch, technical, finesse shot, and power shot as well. As you guys are seeing, there's a common theme with the scoring play styles on the strikers. The majority of them, I should say, they have the power shot. Finesse shot at least one of them on gold, if not both. Janola checks that box right there. Now, Janola is usually good every single year. This year, he hasn't really had a really insane card. I was a fan of his initial um, triple threat card. Pretty solid. The Golasso hero was pretty good as well. But they weren't really top 10 material in my opinion. But with his 98 footies, oof, they improved massively that attack positioning and the dribbling he feels good on the ball very nice and quick very consistent shooting one of the best finishers and what i love about this card is that playing this card as a striker he's very physical very physical very tough to get the ball off this card coming in at number eight is going to be somebody that was on the wingers list just like rivaldo but he's also going to make an appearance for the strikers list today 99 rated footies premium neymar jr we are looking at cards five nine on the height High, high work rates, double five star on the skill moves and weak foot combination, right footed. Acceleration type is explosive, 99 pace, 95 shooting, 96 passing, 99 dribbling, 76 physicality as well. Play styles that Mr. Neymar comes with, inside the pass, technical, Travella, flare, and first touch, all on basic. And then the four gold play styles, quick step, trickster, whip pass, and finesse shot as well. So the only con with this card is the physicality and his body type aside from that perfect dribbling perfect pace really nice and consistent shooting i love the playmaking on this card he's probably one of the better if not one of the best strikers in mc24 able to play make with the basically maxed out passing and whip pass on goal play style very nice and meta can play either the striker or the winger spot very efficiently all right boys we're getting into the top seven and i'm going to be completely honest Number seven through one can be completely interchangeable, whatever order you would like, because they are very overpowered. And like I said before, you can put them in whichever order, depending how you're waking up that day. But number seven for me is going to be footies, 99 rated Erlen Hallett, 6'5 on the height, high medium work rates, double five star on the skill moves and weak foot combination, left footed, acceleration type is controlled lengthy 98 pace 99 shooting 90 passing 93 dribbling 98 physicality as well play styles that mr holland comes with power shot power header acrobatic quick step all on basic and then the four gold play styles aerial press proven rapid and finesse shot as well like i said before all about preference i love holland every single year in fifa he's a very simplistic type of player where all you got to do is cross the ball back post to him he wins every single one-on-one -on -one header. If not, spam some stepovers. It's impossible to get past this card, or I should say impossible to catch up to the card with the insane pace. The physicality, arguably the strongest striker in MC 24 and the finishing arguably the best as well, but he also has five-star skills. So double five Holland was bound to make this list. Definitely top 10 material at least. Coming in at number six, boys, it's gonna be 99 rated. Footies Icon Eusebio. Number six, Eusebio. Some people are going to be like, what? I know, guys. Like I said, number seven through one can be completely interchangeable. Five, nine on the height. 
high medium work rates, double five star in the skill moves and weak foot combination, right footed acceleration type is controlled, explosive 97 pace, 99 shooting, 90 passing, 95 dribbling, 92 physicality as well. Play styles that the man comes with, chip shot, rapid flare, first touch, trickster, aerial, acrobatic, and travella. All on basic and then the four gold play styles, quick step, technical, finesse shot, and power shot as well. We all know Eusebio's body every single year in FIFA, always nice with the left stick dribbling, very consistent shooting, if not one of the best finishers, very quick with the pace. Only thing the card is missing every single year, at least in the beginning, is the five star skill moves. And him having five star skill moves, it's game over. Absolutely game over, boys. He's arguably top five. He's arguably number one. He's without that one of the best strikers in the game. Look at the shooting category, dribbling, just impeccable, boys. Absolutely impeccable. Definitely an SPC you should complete if you want to have one of the best cards in the video game. Coming in at number five is going to be 99 rated footies premium Cristiano Ronaldo, guys. One of my favorite players every single year in FIFA. Number five, we're looking at cards 6-2 on the height, high medium work rates. Double five stars and skill moves and weak foot combination, right footed. Acceleration type is controlled. 96 pace, 99 shooting, 92 passing, 99 dribbling, 90 physicality as well. Play styles that the man CR7 comes with. Chip shot, dead ball, first touch, flare, travella, acrobatic, and aerial. All on basic. And then the four gold play styles, rapid, power header, power shot, and finesse shot as well. Same exact vibes. For Eusebio, CR7 is usually meta every single year in FIFA, especially the more and more we go into the year, the more special cards he gets. The only thing that the card was missing is really nice dribbling. Everything is 99 except for balance, which is 96. Shooting is maxed out. Pace and physicality, amazing. And the other thing that he was missing was the five-star weak foot. Yes, he probably has the best four-star weak foot, if not the second best. But him having that five-star weak foot being double five, Gives you an extra layer of cushing knowing this card is going to be very consistent and arguably the best finisher in the video game. Coming in at number four is going to be 99 rated footies icon Pele. This man, absolutely insane of a card. 5'8 on the height, high medium work rates, double five star on the skill moves and weak foot combination, right footed. Acceleration type is mostly explosive. 96 pace, 99 shooting, 93 passing, 97 dribbling. 82 physicality as well. Play styles that Mr. Pele comes with. Finesse shot, inside the pass, ping pass, flare, first touch, trickster, acrobatic, and quick step. All on basic. And then the four gold play styles, Travella, technical, tiki taka, and power shot as well. A very nice and metal card, y'all boys. <laughs> Look at the shooting. He's arguably the best dribbler in EFC 24, along with Neymar. Look at the dribbling stats once again. And then you combine that with the technical on gold. You already know he's going to feel top tier on the ball, especially the left stick dribbling. Pace, very quick, very consistent shooting. Pele, a little bit of a liability with his four-star weak foot of his previous special cards. But 99 rated footies Pele, along with the birthday. Him having that five-star weak foot gives you that extra cushion. Because Pele, for the most part, every single year in FIFA is perfect. He's just missing that five-star weak foot. And then once he gets that five-star weak foot, he's automatically, in my opinion top five material you can put him anywhere between numbers five through one but you guys know me for me he's going to be number four on today's list coming in at number three is going to be 98 rated greats of the game icon johan cruyff this card is very broken maybe not a lot of people like cruyff this year especially throughout the end of the year cycle but i feel like he slept on and for me still top five material 511 on the height high low work rates double five star on the skill moves and weak foot combination right footed acceleration type is mostly explosive 95 pace 99 shooting 96 passing 99 dribbling 82 physicality as well play styles that mr croif comes with chip shot inside the pass take taka trickster flare travella and relentless all on basic and then the four gold play styles quick step first touch power shot and finesse shot as well so croif just like with pele just like with neymar arguably the best dribbler in the game very nice and consistent shooting. Everything is 99 in the shooting category. Not only that, but you combine him having two of the best scoring play styles on gold. So you already know the versatility with the scoring outside the box and inside the box is definitely there. 
very quick with the pace like i said before very nice playmaking as well with the passing just overall a complete powerhouse let me know what you guys think about 98 Cruyff this year all right we're getting into the top two and numbers two and one can be completely interchangeable once again number two 98 rated UEFA Euro team of the tournament Kylian Mbappe come on guys Mbappe always a staple point every single year in FIFA six foot on the height high low work rates five star skills with four star weak foot combination right foot acceleration type controlled explosive 99 pace 98 shooting 91 passing 99 dribbling 91 physicality as well play styles that Mbappe comes with chip shot technical rapid Trevella flair and first touch all on basic and then the four gold play styles quick step press proven finesse shot and power shot as well now there's not really much to say about killing Mbappe very overpowered down the wing very overpowered centrally as a striker in my opinion Mbappe has the best four star weak foot some people may disagree with me on that but that's just based off of my experience but aside from that there's no denying the quality when it comes to the finishing on the strong foot the speed and explosiveness whenever he performs a step over or just the speed in general 99 pace rocket the chip on gold he's arguably the quickest player in mc 24 look at the dribbling as well everything is pretty much maxed out insane physicality with 99 stamina to last you the whole game i don't think there's a debate when it comes to how good and the quality that Mbappe offers on the pitch but I think top five is definitely safe to say and for me concluding the strikers this year he's going to be number two for me but for me concluding the strikers list for EFC 24 ultimate team in the month of September 98 rated greats of the game icon R9 is going to take the number one spot some people may say insane R9 bias but that's just my experience with the card in my opinion six foot on the height high medium work rates double five star on the skill moves and weak foot combination right foot acceleration top is controlled explosive 99 pace 99 shooting 86 passing 97 dribbling 84 physicality as well play styles that mr r9 comes with power shot ping pass technical relentless rapid flare and trickster all on basic and then the four goal play styles with this man quick step First touch, dead ball, well, excuse me, not dead ball, I thought that was dead ball, chip shot, and finesse shot as well. You guys know me, I'm a huge fan of R9 every single year in FIFA, but with this greats of the game icon, I don't know, I just don't see anybody better than him. Yes, you can make an argument with Haaland, Eusebio, CR7, Cruyff, Pele, even Mbappe, but R9 is just him. Max out pace, max out shooting, for me the best finisher by far in AFC 24 very nice dribbling very nice physicality r9 has that unique body type that whenever you're dribbling and spamming step overs with the card it's very difficult to knock the ball off this card so that's something i absolutely love from him and that's why for me he's going to be number one on the list you guys let me know in the comment section below what do you guys think about my list for the final list of the top 10 strikers in AFC 24 ultimate team you guys feel like somebody on the list is too high up and they should be moved down a little bit more or somebody on the list is too low and they should be moved higher up just a bit more once again if your favorite striker is not on today's list it's not because i don't rate them it's not because that i think that they are bad it's just i think that these are slightly more meta and more overpowered concluding this year's fifa cycle so just let me know in the comment section and we can have a friendly discussion thank you guys so much for the support on the videos you guys are absolutely amazing very close to 10,000 subscribers if you guys haven't already feel free to hit that subscribe button would be very greatly appreciated god bless i will be dropping one final video one final video which will be coming the next couple of days and then after that video we will be taking a break for efc 25 so if you guys haven't already drop a like in this video i'll see you guys next time very very soon until next time it's been your boy dan fifa I am out. Bye-bye.